All right, guys, I do have a Thursday morning editorial for you. Now, yesterday I had mentioned that I was going to talk about an officer that bites another officer. We're going to talk about that right now. So it actually comes to us from <clears throat> Fox 13 in Memphis, but it has to do with an Atlanta police officer. It's just the best story I found to give you. Uh, it was from Fox 13. They covered it the best for me. So I'm going to give it to you right now and then see what you got to say in the comment section below about this. I will put a link to this full story in the description box, as always, so you can go read it for yourself as well. Thank you, Fox 13 Memphis, for this story. An Atlanta police officer has been relieved of her duties after investigators said she attacked a fellow officer and tried to run him over with a car. Investigators said an off-duty Atlanta Police Department officer was helping with traffic flow at a Wells Fargo bank along Camp Creep Parkway when Lieutenant Sharon Steed refused to follow the officer's directions. Lieutenant Steed continued to defy the officer's orders and ultimately bumped her vehicle into him, Atlanta police said in a news release Tuesday. Police said the off-duty officer tried to get Steed out of the car and she resisted, ultimately biting the officer's hand. She bit the hand that fed her. Maybe. I don't know. <laughs> Moving on. Investigators said at some point during the incident, Steed identified herself as an Atlanta police officer. The department said several APD uh, supervisors were then dispatched to the bank to investigate. Following the investigation, officers took out several felony warrants against Steed, charging her with obstruction, aggravated assault, and violation of oath by a public officer. Steed has been relieved of her duties until her case can be adjudicated. Police said she turned herself in to the Fulton County Jail on Tuesday. Steed has worked as a supervisor at the department's airport precinct and has been with the department since July of 1997. So um, apparently this off-duty police officer was trying to help with traffic flow. She comes along and says, I'm a lieutenant and I'm going through. Bye-bye. I love that this cop didn't treat her special and say, yes, you can go through too or whatever. He said, look, hold on, I'm, hold on, hold on. You know, and but she bit him. That's right. She bit him on the fucking hand. Um, so questions arise now. How many people has this officer assaulted on her job and just said, well, the person resisted or this happened and I had to take, you know, use force. How many times has she done that? Because obviously she's capable of it, right? She bit a fellow officer on the hand who was just trying to do his job, right? Or was he trying to do his job? Was he assaulting her? We don't know, huh? What really happened? But she did run into him with her car, it says. I mean, from this story right here, pretty much um, she's at fault. And uh, I don't know. I'm trying to figure, I'm trying to work it out in my head here. I'm, I've raised a lot of questions for myself, probably raised a lot of questions for you. Like what really happened there? See, nobody was recording. Apparently, there's nobody there that no cop watchers were there. We needed a cop watcher there to give us some video footage. But uh, regardless of what was going on there, you have a police officer who was directing the flow of traffic. You have a police lieutenant who said, no, I'm going through, bumped him with her car, tried to pull her out of the car. She bit the guy in the hand. Bottom line, the police lieutenant was wrong. Whatever. She should have just waited and then went her turn like everybody else. That's how I feel. I don't know if you guys feel different. But again, I think she was just like, I'm a lieutenant. I can do what the fuck I want. I'm in charge. Who is this cop to tell me what to do? That's how I feel. That's my opinion. We needed video. Guys, pick up cameras and start recording because we need your videos on these cops. Thank you for watching. Community Leo Watch. Watching Leos. That's law enforcement officers from coast to coast. And I want to hear you what you have to say about this story. A lieutenant. That bit a fellow officer. Happy Thursday, guys. Sorry it's so short, but I just had to give you this one. It's great. I'm going to belabor this. I'm going to keep talking to irritate my trolls. Thank you, guys. Happy Thursday.